Alright, let's go ahead and take a look at how we can do some basic texturing of an object. In the hierarchy, let's go to our Create, go down to the 3D Objects and click on Cube. With a cube inside the scene, let's take a quick look at what the textures are for an object. Over in the Inspector side, if your cube selected, you'll notice that you have a Mesh Renderer and you have a Default Diffuse. The Default Diffuse Shader uh, is actually grayed out. That means that this isn't one that we can actually use, this is one that Unity is loaning to us so we can see it inside the viewport. So we'll need to make a new material and then we can assign a texture to that. Above it is the material. This is the material slot that's being used, default diffuse. If you see it, you may see your mesh renderer like this and it rolled up. Just click on the triangle to take it down. So let's go ahead and make a new material over in the project side. Over on the left, you'll see your materials folder. Just right click on it and go to the create. Go down to material and click on material. And let's just type the name in for cube. Since it's cube, we'll just use cube. Keep everything consistent. Let's go ahead and left click and drag this onto the cube. Remember, when you do that, you're actually replacing the cube so it's no longer the default material and the cube comes with a shader by default is the diffuse we can now change the shader to different ones we can also apply a texture to it and we can change the color so let's do the color real fast just so you can see it working if you click on main color box it'll open up the color picker window inside of here just left click and drag anywhere you click you'll notice you're going to change and update the color over here. You can change your hue or your color option bar right here and be able to adjust the color to uh, on that one as well. To get rid of the window you can either push enter here or you can just left click inside the window and it'll uh, it'll go away there. What I want to do though, let's make sure we leave the color white. So we'll leave it like this. And we don't have any textures inside of here. So let's go ahead and get some textures from Unity. If we go up to our assets on the menu bar and go down to where you see import package. In the import package, if you go down, what you'll probably see is something like terrain assets. Um, let's go ahead and go to, actually I think that'll be a good one. Let's do terrain assets right there. All right. When you click on it, it'll do the importing package option. Go down to the bottom right and say import. When it imports, it's going to create a folder called standard assets. And if you notice, it's outside of our level design, and that's good. That's where we want it. So if you open it up, I remember when you're opening things up, if you want to open all of them up at the same time like that, you can hold alt and left click on the arrow. If you want to roll it back up so that it's all compressed, hold Alt and close, and it'll be all closed. So Alt and left click will roll it all the way out. Alt and closing will keep it all together. So we have a couple of textures in here. We have some grass textures that we can use on a terrain a little bit later. We've got some different types for uh, cliffs and rocks. Let's take the uh, the cliff one right here and just left click. Let's see, we'll take our cube. Let's see if you select your cube or you select your cube here, either one. We'll left click and drag our cliff layer. And you can actually, if you notice, I can drag it onto here or I can drag it over to here. You can also click on that select button right there. And when you click on it, you'll be able to see a different texture and you can cycle through the textures and see them applied to the cube over here. Alright, if you like it, you can push enter. So you now have a texture assigned to the cube, and it's going to be on all the faces of it. There we go. So it's very basic, but straight to the point of your object with a material being assigned and a texture being assigned to that.